The following video is sponsored by MobileMaddenCoins.com. If you're looking for Madden coins on any console or platform, be sure to check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID for a 10% discount. Yo, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. Guys, what I have for you today is a ridiculous glitch that was in Madden 17 Ultimate Team today. And those of you that saw this screen probably made a ton of coins this afternoon. This is the Elite Player Upgrade. It was under the Burn Badges set. Okay, so if you went in there, you would be able to see this. What you see on your screen is that it requires 5 85 to 86 overall elite players, and in return, you get an 87 overall elite player that's auctionable. So it's basically an upgrade, an elite upgrade. Now, my opinion was that this set is really not worth it. However, take a look at what you were able to add into this set. You saw a bronze card there. You're going to see another bronze card here. Add to sets, elite player upgrade. Yes. For about 5 to 10 minutes earlier this afternoon, you were able to add any player into this set. Any player at all. And basically, guys, this made it so that obviously you're getting rid of your bronzes and your silvers for that little short period of time. We Most of us assumed this was a glitch and it was going to be coming out of the game. But you know what, man? If you don't take advantage of this kind of stuff when it's in the game, it's really difficult because basically what happens is that the elite players that you have right now on your team, all of them tank in value when this kind of stuff happens. When EA puts in something that is just this broken, <laughs> I mean, like, I, I have no words for how ridiculously broken this is. And basically, guys, what you're seeing right now is that, yes, every single time that I add five of these players into the set, I'm going to get an 87 overall or above elite player. Yeah, ridiculously OP. I mean, we're talking about potential pulls of Odell Beckham Jr., J.J. Watt, I mean, Luke Keekly. I mean, ridiculous ones. Cam Newton, Antonio Brown. Like, all of these guys were possible to pull in the game through this set. And, again, it was very, very short. There was not a lot of time for this. I didn't see a whole lot of people talking about it on Twitter so, uh, yeah, I mean, we really didn't have time to get information out about it. I was considering making a video, depending on how long it took, that kind of showed how to do it. But I guess we kind of are here. Um, but unfortunately, it's kind of too late at this point. But I just wanted to show you guys this set. Um, and unfortunately, if those of you who didn't take advantage of it, if you didn't see it, if you didn't know about it, you maybe lost out on some coins and lost out on some free elite players. But again, <laughs> it wasn't up for a whole lot of time. So I was actually only able to get four players. So that should show you, again, how, how short of an amount of time that it was actually up for. There are other YouTubers out there today that you're going to see. I think Texas Boy, uh, Victionary, and I believe that dude Sly. I think all three of them knew about it pretty quickly. So they were doing it pretty quickly as well. Um, so they might have more. I think that I heard Vic and uh, Tex both had 10. I was in a Skype call with them. They added me in there to um, tell me about it, but I already had heard about it. But um yeah, like I said, I think that they are they got like 10 or maybe even a little bit more than that. So make sure you guys go over there. I think they're going to be putting out a video. I don't know if together or what. I think they were, cahoot, they were in cahoots doing something or other. Uh, <laughs> so hopefully they'll put out a cool video either separate or together. Uh, and then also, obviously, that dude Sly did one as well. I don't know if anybody else has them out. But be on the lookout for these because I think that you're going to see some pretty nice pulls coming out of these things. So with that said, guys, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to show you guys what I got out of my Elite pull. So here's what I got out of mine. If you go in here, you're going to see it was an elite reward pack. And the first one that we get is Chris Harris Jr. So an 87 overall, probably one of the lower ones that you could pull. But still, for five bronze players, I mean, like, that was definitely worth it for me. Next one, we get a Chris Harris. <laughs> like, okay, we got two Chris Harrises. So I guess I'll probably end up having to sell one of those or give one away or something like that. Uh, but then in the third one, we're going to get something a little bit different here. Something pretty damn beastly, and that is Cam Chancellor. Not too shabby. Pretty nice pull. And then the fourth and final one, we get a Richie Incognito. So nothing crazy out of mine, but still, four random elite pulls that I would have definitely not gotten if they didn't put this in the game. So thank you, EA, I guess, for giving me free elites. But I can see why people that have stacked elite teams right now would be pissed off. So with that being said, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor. Quickly drop a like on this one. Thank you so much for the support, and I will talk to you guys again soon.